you are in received a summon for questioning on drug charges. On February 27, the Drug Crime Investigation Unit of the Seoul Metropolitan Police Agency, MFDS, compared and analyzed the propofol prescription status and actual medical records of UI in from the Ministry of Food and Drug Safety. In addition, the police will continue to investigate whether UI in habitually used propofol last year and whether any other narcotics besides propofol and hemp were administered. Recently, Yuan was suspected of habitual use of propofol. On February 5, the police seized and searched the body of Yuan when he entered the country through Incheon International Airport after a trip to the United States. A urine test was conducted, hair was also collected, and analysis was requested from the National Institute of Scientific Investigation. After the results were revealed, it was found that hemp and third narcotic components were also detected in addition to propofol. In response, the police planned to secure Yua in cell phone and summon him as a suspect for investigation as soon as the digital forensic results are released. As the investigation of the references of the hospital officials, including the doctor who prescribed propofol to Yuan In, is underway, it seems that the summoning investigation of Yuan In will begin soon. It has been revealed that Yuan In took propofol a total of 73 times from January 4, 2021, to December 23 of the same year. The public's attention is also focused on the issues to be revealed in the additional investigation. Meanwhile, Yuan was scheduled to release various works this year, such as the Netflix movie The Match, the Netflix series Goodbye Earth, and the film High Five, but his latest drug controversy is causing much trouble in the premiere of the works lined up this year. Love